What's up, guys? You know this guy, Leslie. He's the one that broke my capture card during last time's stream. <laughs> it's my son. Well, we're just here at my credit union picking up some money so that, uh, uh, some picking up some of that YouTube money and that Twitch money. Just kidding, guys. I'm not that, I'm not that good. I'm not PewDiePie good. Uh, to uh, some bird crap or something up there. That's right, right here. Anyway, uh, to uh, go pick up the wife a new truck. Uh, we're getting her a 99 uh, Ford Expedition. Um, so yeah, that's going to be fun. So run all the way up to Salt Lake, Provo, Orem, that area. It's all basically the same, you know. They all don't know how to fucking drive, but my French. And so I figured, you know what, why not vlog the entire thing? So this is us leaving before, okay? Uh, and the next video will probably be at the dealership. Um, where we're looking at the, the truck. Um, I suggested that she actually gets a pickup, a full-blown pickup, like a Ram 1500 or a F-150 or even a 1500 Chevy or, you know, something like something with a, a truck bed so I can haul some shit to the dump because I've got some old car parts that uh, I need to scrap. And uh, there's no rag and bones guys that come around here, which is kind of weird. Uh, if you guys don't know what a rag and bones guy is, uh, in England, there's uh, scrap, me scrap metal merchants, basically. They, they have like an old horse and cart and they'd sell, they'd yell rag and bones, rag and bones. Basically, it just means uh, washing machines, uh, appliances that are broken that you don't want anymore, that are just left on the side of the road, you know, for the rubbish men to pick up. Well, a rag and bones guy will pick them up and scrap them out for scrap metal and make, make his living that way. Uh, there was an old TV show called Steptoe and Son, uh, where it was talking about rag and bones guys. I don't know why my skin's all jaundice over. It looks like I got punched in the eye. But uh, yeah, and um, so yeah, America doesn't have any rag and bones guys, which is kind of weird. So uh, I'll see you in the next part, guys, because my battery's almost dying and I need to use a charger. So, join then, guys. That's the minion. Hi guys. Sorry about it. we didn't do an update. Ah, zoom out camera. Sorry, didn't do an update. Um, we didn't get the truck we wanted. Um, apparently, it had a broken engine mount and a really bad lifter tick and a whole bunch of other things. When I looked, lifted up the hood, I swear I saw a steam cloud of a skull and crossbones that said, save me, you know? <laughs> Ain't gonna happen. Um, so, we ended up getting something else. We are in, we're in a Ford, but it's not a truck which is kind of new for me, and new for her, the Baroness. <laughs> we are in a Focus. So everyone's like, hey, great gas mileage. And we got it at Murray's Hyundai. Hyundai of all places. Now, you guys know how I feel about buying the enemy's vehicles from an enemy's dealership. So in theory, why would we buy a Ford from a Hyundai dealership? So yeah, anyway. Uh, we're gonna go find something to eat and then we're gonna get ready for the trip home. Um, it, I've lost Leslie somewhere. Yeah, he, he's like right behind us probably. <laughs> and uh, so yeah, we're on our way to find a Burger King or something to chow down on. Anyway guys, don't worry, I will be live streaming. It'll be a little bit delayed because uh, it's gonna be about a two hour drive home. Um, especially with uh, current traffic and stuff like that. So until then guys, don't worry. I'll see you soon. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> I hope. If this car doesn't kill me. Uh, I, I wouldn't worry about our car. I would worry about the asshole that's on my ass. All right. Well, asshole, get off the ass. Anyway, guys, take care. Hey guys, it is like midnight. Almost. 10, Ten o'clock, midnight, same fucking thing. Uh, we are currently at our local Walmart in Price. And this is what we bought. It's a charcoal grey Ford Focus. Let's zoom out. It's got a little love tap on the passenger side, but what do you expect for 1500 bucks out the door? Tax, license, everything. And we got it from Murray Murdoch. Right there. Thank you guys. You guys did uh, wonderful. Didn't they, Baroness? Yes. Yes. She's oh. stuffy. So, and she forgot her purse. Don't let her. And so there you go, guys. 
I'm going in here to get me a uh, micro HDMI adapter so I can run this thing as a webcam for when I do the live PC builds and stuff. So uh, I've got to turn the camera off now because Walmart doesn't like cameras in their store that they don't own. So, talk to you guys later. Nice. Bye. Sun's out, so I'm going to white balance. It's going to be horrible. But I wanted to show you the car with the sunlight out. As you can see, not bad, not bad for the price we paid. But got a love tap here, which is actually not a bad idea for me doing a YouTube video on how to pull dents out your car. So, uh, and the paint's a little bit scratched in certain places, but that's okay. We can easily get some touch up paint from a local Ford dealership. Uh, and uh, yeah. Whoa, go away, Hornet. Psh, be gone. And of course, there's our baby. She's got to go to the shop today. So, this is the current ride we've got. We named it Ellie Mae. And, uh, yeah. Ugh. Here it is, guys, the ride. This is Ellie Mae. And uh, we're off to go get some lunch. And then uh, this video is going to go up on YouTube. And then we're going to go and uh, have some fun. Uh, uh, flying around in war thunder. So until then guys, take care and I will see you in the skies. There you go my nation. You wanted to see them. There's mama dog and two of her babies. There's Dottie and Montgomery. You see these two all the time on my stream. They're sharing an ice cream cone on a nice hot day. <laughs> mama. Okay, let the babies have the rest. Let the babies have Back some. Up. Let the babies have some. Thank you, Mama. You just ate half the cone. Thank you, Mama. Say hi. Hi. Hi, YouTubes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, careful, Mommy. They might get brain freeze. <laughs> They're okay. Trust me. I didn't see it in their face. <laughs> hey, Nation. What's up? Uh, we just come back from a wonderful, wonderful meal at our local restaurant called Grubbox. Uh, these guys are awesome. They serve a burger called the Fat Boy. Um, two patties, bacon, cheese, onions, pickles, lettuce, the works. Oh my god. It is my crack. It is my biggest crack. I, I don't tend to go to fast food restaurants, but this doesn't, to me, this, this isn't fast food because they don't have the burgers waiting for you. They, 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 they press the patties, they do everything to order. So, you know, they take a whole bunch of ground beef and, you know, make the patties and everything else and whatnot, so. <laughs> and the puppies are going nuts eating the ice cream. <laughs> the puppies are going nuts eating the ice cream, guys. <laughs> okay, let me break it. Me break Life it. is beautiful. See the sunshine in it, my friends. There you go. And to all my brothers out there who are suffering from PTSD, Yesterday when we went to go get the car, we were at traffic light and there was a guy holding up a sign saying he was a veteran and he suffered from PTSD and if you could give anything, please do. And it, it, hurt, my, it hurt my soul, man. It didn't just hurt me personally, it hurt my soul. Um, I'll talk more about that in a, in a politically incorrect podcast, but uh, it, just know, guys, it hurt my soul, you know. And, um, well, we're on our way home, and uh, we've got a very happy mama. A very, very, very happy mama. <laughs> <laughs> and a very, very, be very happy. And a very, very, very happy Baroness, who doesn't like always being on camera, because she seems to think that she's ugly as Medusa when she's not. She's the most attractive thing in the universe to me. And that's all that matters. Anyway, guys. Take care and I'll see you on the next bit of video.